We don't want them on the street no more than anyone else does. Mike Dawson, owner of Five Star Firearms in Seven Hills, has a policy of selling high-capacity magazines and drums to law enforcement only. While Colorado shooter James Holmes purchased his firearms legally, Dawson feels online gun sites and illegal gun purchases are putting firearms in the wrong hands. There's no reason for a civilian to have a 100-round drum for an AR-15. Dawson believes gun control is not the answer and that with the crime rate rising, people need to be able to defend themselves. Out of all the people in that movie theater, not one person was armed is kind of a, kind of surprises me. They don't need more laws on handguns or on guns, period. What they need to do is have a strict enforcement of the gun laws that they have on the books today. You're never going to be able to stop a madman, okay, by legislation. Kim Rodecker is a firearms instructor at concealed carry courses in Cleveland. He believes the theater shooting, while tragic, could have been ended sooner by someone taking charge. As soon as they saw that man come in and start killing innocent people, innocent children, women, men, you know, there could have been one person there with his own firearm who could have ended it. Dawson believes someone had to have known Holmes was stockpiling firearms and could have tipped somebody off. The fact that it did not happen does not change his stance that gun control is not the answer. There's millions of guns out there, and it would take 200 years to even think about stopping firearms. In Seven Hills, Bob Fenner, News Channel 5.